assembling your new Benini Enchanted Maiden Fountain. Step 1. Base and Large Bowl Assembly To begin assembly of your new Enchanted Maiden Fountain, place the base of the fountain on a steady level surface. Apply steady pressure to the bottom of the base by stepping on the edge of it to prevent the base from turning. Align the two matching grooves, the first at the bottom of the large bowl and the second at the top of the base. Connect the bowl to the base and turn the large bowl a quarter turn clockwise to lock it in place. Step 2. Enchanted Maiden Topper Installation Feed the black water pump cord into the pipe in the centre of the large bowl. Firmly press the plug into the end of the pipe in the middle of the large bowl. You should allow 6 or 7 inches of the cord to stick out of the top of the plug. Connect the Enchanted Maiden Fountain Topper to the large bowl by aligning the two grooves and then rotate the Maiden a quarter turn clockwise to lock it in place. Step 3. Battery Installation Gently pull down the two cords from inside the open battery compartment. Connect the colour-coded cords to their corresponding receptacles labelled on the connection port. Blue to blue and black to black. Place the connection port inside the designated angled area located at the back of your fountain base, leaving the grey cable sticking out. Attach the grey cable of the connection port to the grey cable on the battery. Carefully insert the battery into the fountain, making sure that it is not upside down. Once the battery has been inserted into its compartment, you should then place the battery compartment door on the base of the fountain. Start by lining up the notch on the bottom of the compartment door with the notch in the bottom of the battery opening. Push the battery compartment door in toward the base. You will know it is in position when the magnet locks the door in place. You may notice a small notch at the bottom left corner of the fountain door. This is for the optional Benini solar panel cord. When removing the battery compartment door, gently pull the door outward from the top. Then pull the battery compartment door up and out from the base. Do not overextend the battery compartment door by pulling down as this may damage the fountain. Step 4. Setting up your fountain. Fill the floral fountain tier until water pours over the edges. Then fill the large bowl until water is about one inch from the top of the bowl. After you have filled your fountain, press the B button once to turn the fountain on. Once the water fills, if it fails to run properly or makes a loud noise, don't worry, the problem is just air bubbles in the water pump. Press button B to turn the fountain off. Grab both sides of the fountain and shake your fountain quickly for 10 seconds. This will remove any air bubbles that may be caught in your water pump. Press the B button again to turn your fountain on. If the problem persists, turn it off and shake the fountain again. The onboard control panel is located at the top of the base of the fountain. It features two buttons, A and B. Pressing the A button once turns on the fountain for one hour and then shuts down. Pressing the A button twice causes it to run for two hours, three times for three hours, and four times for four hours. Button B is the manual on-off switch. When pressed once, it will turn the fountain on until the battery runs down, or manually turn it off by pressing the B button a second time. If you are having trouble getting water to flow evenly off of the spouts on your fountain, you may need to level the surface that your fountain is placed on. Place a shim underneath the base on the opposite side that is not flowing as strongly as the other sides. Grab the shim and break it on the crease closest to the base. Cleaning the water pump. You will want to clean your water pump filter and impeller approximately every six months. Remove the front of the water pump by grabbing the sides of the front panel and pulling it off the unit. Remove the water pump filter and wash thoroughly under running water. Remove the impeller cover and then remove the impeller from its chamber. Rinse the impeller under running water and then place the impeller, the impeller cover and the filter back into the pump and then put the pump's front panel back on. You are now ready to enjoy your Benini Enchanted Maiden Fountain.